It's one of the greatest big league scouts of all time. The great Red Murph actually resides here in Tyler and Simple World Films is making a movie about one of his unique discoveries. Here's CBS 19's Mike Alzamora with more. Eric, it was Red Murph who discovered the great Nolan Ryan and many other big league greats, but it was an unusual find back in 1975, which is now on its way to the silver screen as the best hitter. Very efficient. And he hit the ball with authority. Gosh, he was a good hitter. The now 87-year-old Murph is referring to a true diamond in the rough named Ricky Hill, whom he stumbled upon in a tryout camp in Brenham, Texas, back in 1975. This young man, Ricky Hill, was certainly the best hitter that ever came through one of our camps. Even though he suffered from a degenerative spine disease, Hill went on to play five seasons with the Montreal Expos. His condition eventually ended his career, but none of it would have been possible had Red not given him a chance. What do you think about the fact that, that he, they're making a movie about him and you have a lot to do with that? I feel good. In fact is, Murph almost did not give him that chance. In a similar way as to how Rudy did at Notre Dame, Hill went up to Murph and literally told him he was the best hitter at that camp. The next day, he showed him. That's a good feeling. When he gets to the camp, he is certainly number one. The movie The Best Hitter is expected to hit theaters in the fall of 2009. Mike Alzamora, CBS 19 Sports.